Most people in life are looking at how do I make a life worth living in retirement with having. What is totally offensive to anyone in the white community is when someone who is of a different nationality presumes to have the right to ask about something that is out of sight, that has never been shown to that individual. And openly, it's an in an appropriate question of trying to solicit a conversation. The question of, is that your computer too? Is that thing yours too? Is ill-willed? The item is not in display at this time. The information is none of your business as a stranger to me, and openly any white person would feel that. What we get really tired about in our Caucasianness with people of other different nationalities is that they're more interested in looking at our property values as opposed to us as a human being in the house of God. The Lord Jesus is very upset with people when he goes into the temple and turns the entire coffers of those merchants and those priests over. I hate Christians, I'll just tell you straight out. I have no desire to be anywhere near a Catholic except for one who I love more than you could possibly imagine. She's the one who inspired my writing my book and she openly helped me to do a hell of a lot in a very short period of time for my life. But don't you tell me what I am and don't you try to predict what I'm going to become because God has my life and you don't. Lord Odin is more powerful than you could possibly imagine. And here's the problem that Christians really run into. They want to profess they understand the Trinity, but then they're terrified to hear from him. You see, the Holy Ghost is touted in John chapter 10 in particular, the Good Shepherd. But at what point are you shepherding someone into God's house, or are you pushing them away and repelling them because of your behavior, your immoral thought, and your inappropriate access to their lives?